William Wells Brown was born on a plantation near Lexington, Kentucky in 1814. He was the son of a white man and an enslaved woman. Uh, he lived around St. Louis, Missouri until the age of 20. Um, because Brown was a mixed slave, he worked in the house clean, uh, helping clean at the younger age. And as he got older, uh, he then turned into a field slave and worked with um, other slaves on the plantation. Um, as a house slave, his master was Dr. Young, a young politician who was rarely on the plantation. And his overseer was a tyrant and his name was Mr. Cook. Um, later, he was hired out as an assistant to a tavern keeper, a printer, and the slave trader, James Walker. In trying to escape multiple times, William's mother was sold away and he never saw her again. Uh, in the next clip, I will be showing a reenactment of Wells trying to escape. Come back here, boy! <laughs> 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 Get up, boy. Get up, boy. Hey, master, we got you one. God damn, Will. I knocked the shoes off this <laughs> bastard. <laughs> Give me that. What you laughing at? <laughs> Will. <laughs> Will. <laughs> Will. Sick of talking. Blacks leaving. Fucking running away. Why are you running away? You don't like it here? You don't like no. it here? You don't have a joint! <laughs> I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you what I'm about. God. How many letters in your name, Will? <laughs> That's why I thought. He adopted the name Wells Brown from a Quaker who aided him in his uh, flight from Ohio to Canada. That's how he escaped. Uh, that's, how, that's how he finally was able to escape um, slavery. Uh, out of gratitude, he adopted the name Wells Brown um, out of gratitude and administration. Uh, after being free for nine years, he worked aboard the Lake Erie Steamboat uh, while Concurrently, uh, he was an Underground Railroad conductor. Brown moved to Boston in 1847, where he started a literary career writing his narrative. Uh, three years in Europe, I have met the present daughter and many more. Unfortunately, William Wells Brown died November the 6th, 1884. <laughs> Yeah. Are you recording? Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh wait. Oh wait. <laughs> I didn't even go. <laughs> Set. Go. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Get on here, boy. We got you, one master. Hey, master. We got you. Go. Oh my God, no, man. No, you gotta come and take it from him.